In this training video, we will learn the following about processing and posting accounts receivable invoices. How to properly fill out the session information screen. What to use for the invoice number field. How to code the revenue line properly. What to enter in the transaction description field. And how to run an unposted transaction report and post the session. First, you'll need to enter accounts receivable invoices by clicking on accounts receivable on the navigator toolbar and then on the Enter Manual Invoices icon. Next, you need to enter the session information. For accounts receivable invoices, we recommend beginning the session ID using AR, which represents accounts receivable, and then the two-digit year, month, and day. Any other designation may be added to the end as you deem necessary. Labeling session IDs this way will naturally sort your session IDs in date order and by transaction type. Leave the session status as BP, batch to post. This will allow you to review and edit the transactions before posting, and also will allow you to include these transactions on various reports, such as the normal trial balance, expanded general ledger, and statement of revenues and expenditures. The description of the session may be left blank. The session description defaults to the document description, and you will have to delete or replace it with a correct invoice description. Leave the session date as the current date. Click the Start button to access the document information and begin the entry process.